welcome back to my channel. So Brian and I are driving to Cape Liberty, New Jersey for our cruise. We're taking a seven day cruise to the Bahamas and we're so excited. We left at six in the morning and it's about 10.45 now. We're gonna be there in about 45 minutes. So I'll check in with you guys when we get there. So we just got on board and got into our room like we got on for maybe 20 minutes and then the rooms were ready we were just kind of figuring out a few things we made a few reservations and so i'll show you a quick tour of the room and then we're gonna go grab some food and do the rest of the reservations we need to do so this is what it looks like when you come in we have an obstructed balcony view so i'll show you what that looks like in a minute but it's a pretty big room for a cruise ship we have the bathroom which is like pretty nice it's not bad has a lot of storage on either side you have the tv couch a little dresser with a table and then this is the balcony right here so we just came to the top of, or the back of the windjammer and you can have like outdoor seating so we're still in port so you have like the view the city is back that way and they actually had a, at the back a all gluten free section so I got a Caesar salad with no croutons they had for dessert a little creme brulee that was gluten free and then um, I got barbecue chicken mashed potatoes and gravy so I'm gonna try that so right there is the Statue of Liberty, so cool. back from walking around we played pool and went to the bionic bar and walked around the shops a little bit and we're gonna get ready for dinner now it's like five o'clock and our reservations at chops grill are at six o'clock so we'll just get ready and i'll touch base with you when we're heading out there We just got back to our room for the night. It's about 10 o'clock and we're exhausted, so we're gonna go to bed. But we saw the show at Spectra's Cabernet. It was really good. Um, it was interesting, but very entertaining. And we're just gonna go to bed a little early tonight and wake up early to enjoy all the activities they have going on. <music> Good morning guys, so today is the second day of our cruise, the first full day. We're at sea today. I woke up at like 6.45, I went to the gym, it's a little after 8 now, and we're getting ready to go to pickleball, which will be a lot of fun. I've never played and we've both been saying that we want to play. We have pickleball courts in our town, so we're going to try it out and hopefully we're good because there's a pickleball tournament tomorrow morning, which would be cool if we could go in it. But yeah, we're going to get ready for that now and I'll update you. So we just did pickleball for the first time. We we're not good, but we liked it. So we we're gonna practice, and luckily we were with people that were super nice and kind of taught us a little bit. But it was fun. I'm not gonna do it again because it seems like everyone here is like competitive and serious with it. So we don't want to mess people up with that. But it was definitely fun. We just got back to our room and we saw our little towel animal, it's so cute. 
we decided to get a sit down breakfast at the main dining room and it was actually very good we liked it it wasn't it didn't like have too long of a wait or anything and it was nice and relaxing compared to like the hectic wind jammer and everything so that was good so we got lunch at the wind jammer and we just laid out in the sun for a couple hours it was really nice and relaxing i just came back and showered and we're gonna go walk around a little bit and we wanted to the bingo so we're gonna go check that out and that's at four in like about an hour we just got back from bingo we lost it was very intense like my heart was racing the whole time i really wanted to win but it's okay it was still a lot of fun we liked it um we're gonna go do the bumper cars they have going on at the cplex right now so we're gonna go up and check that out and then after we're gonna get come back here and get ready for dinner because it's formal night So we just had dinner. I took a little clip of Brian trying escargot for the first time. He said it was actually really good. Um, but dinner was really good. We had the beef tenderloin. It was really good. We actually discussed it and we thought it was better than the like special steakhouse they had on board that we went to last night. But I just threw on a sweater and we're gonna go back out to a game show. I don't remember which one it is. I, do you remember what it is? I think it's just like adult something game show. Majority, it's majority, majority rules, rules, yeah. So we're gonna go check that out. It starts in like five minutes, so we gotta go head down there now. But I will keep you posted on the rest of the night. We're probably just gonna do the game show, maybe grab a drink, watch, listen to some music, and then go to bed because we have our first port tomorrow morning. So I'll catch up with you guys later. I got back from the gym and got showered off real quick and got ready because we're going to do the skydiving thing on the top deck. We got reservations. So we're gonna go do that and then grab something light to eat and then come back, change to our bathing suits and go to the pool. So I'll take you with us as we go to the indoor skydiving. We just got done with the skydiving thing. It was so much fun. We're gonna try to do it again later in the week if we're able to. And I think they have like ones that you can pay for a longer session. So we might do that. It was a lot of fun and we both did pretty good. So I definitely recommend doing that if you come on a ship that has it. the ship we just kind of walk around we took the shuttle thing that was more of a coach bus to the Ron John's we looked around the shop we got a few things I'll actually go in and show you what I got in a second and then we went to the beach for like an hour hour and a half I took a quick swim honestly the beach wasn't that nice like if we stopped here again I think we would just stay on the boat but um if you go down more south in Florida, I feel like the beaches get nicer the further you go down. But it was still nice to go take a dip in the ocean. It was just so cold. I couldn't even see the ground. and I just felt seaweed. I didn't like it. But um, tomorrow we're going to Nassau. So hopefully the beach is a little nicer there. But we're going to just go chill at the pool for the rest of the evening. We actually just ordered a gluten-free pizza at Sorrento. So we're going to go down after this to go grab that. So I just walked inside and grabbed our little gift bag up for you what we got. So Brian likes to collect shot glasses everywhere he goes. So he got his, is it, it's plastic, I think. But um, it's like a little red solo cup that says Ron John's Surf Shop. Then we got car coasters. So I saw a pack of two car coasters. Um, it was like 13 bucks for two and they were so cute I was going to get it and then I went around the corner and they had a rack of them 
and they were three dollars each so you got two for like six dollars and they were a lot cuter and had so many more options so brian got two he got these two for his car got like an american flag and then the sunset beach hair one and then for my car i got this one and then this one i love them i'm excited to put them in my car and then i also got this it's called sex wax air freshener and it smells like coconut like the beach it smells so good so i grabbed that and then they also gave us two free stickers with our purchase and if you book the excursion through the shuttle transportation through the cruise line they give you a 15 percent off coupon so we got 15 percent off i mean this all this costs like 12 bucks i think it was really cheap so definitely a good spot to grab souvenirs so brian has the blue hawaiian what would you rate it at i take that as he likes it <laughs> So we relaxed at the Slarium. I ended up falling asleep for a good 30 minutes and I definitely got some sun today. It's not too bad. I wore sunscreen and half, but definitely got some sun. I can feel it on my face, but um, we got ready for dinner. We're going to the North Star at seven. So we're gonna go do that. And I'll take you along with us before dinner. breakfast I had some fruit and toast and then Brian actually made his own omelet and he ordered it and they gave him like a little buzzer that he could go back up to get his omelet and he said it was really good and then we did the jogging trail we just did a few laps to get some steps in this morning and I ended up rock climbing and I'll put a little clip that Brian took of me doing it I got scared I was almost at the top and I got too scared so I let go but I'm gonna try that again later in the week and we just got ready. We are going to Nassau, Bahamas today. So I just got dressed and we're going to go hang out at the pool. We get in around noon. So we're just going to relax by the pool for an hour, grab a break, um, some lunch and then head off the ship. And we'll just kind of explore and see where the day takes us. Found one of the rubber duckies that people hide. Kenzie and Izzy. Mm. Pretty cool. Do we rehide it? A, you take it. So we found this pot to rehide it. No, we gotta put it like back more so it's like hidden. You gotta fix the sunglasses. Oh yeah. They're so cute. He's in there. okay we can get off the boat in like 20 minutes and i just finished getting right ready brian went downstairs to get his breakfast but i'll show you kind of what it looks like we're facing the ocean but i'll like turn around the corner and show you and it kind of looks like there's some dark clouds coming in so hopefully they're just passing <laughs> Okay. 
So it's almost one now, or it's just one, and we spent the whole morning at this, what beach was it? South Beach or no? No, it was on Chill Island. It was still on Chill Island, but it was in the back, so it was like so calm, because the other beaches when you were first walking out were super wavy. So we went there, we went snorkeling, we saw a stingray, a shark, and some fish, and now we're just gonna go grab some food. dinner and we're just walking around we're at, at like one of the decks and we're the only ones on it right now so it's really nice we're just enjoying the views and we took some photos but perfect day coke okay was amazing like the best part of the trip the food was so good they had so many gluten-free options um the beaches were amazing we saw sharks stingrays like so much and um, i took a little clip of the iguana i actually saved its life because one of the people driving the cart was about to run it over. I'm like, stop, and then I saved it. But anyways, um, we got back on the boat and just went to the solarium and relaxed there for a little bit before we got ready for dinner. And then tonight we're going to a comedy show at 10.30, so hopefully it's really funny. The first comedian that they had on board was like a juggling comedian, but he was so funny. And it was like, there's four kids too, but we thought it was hilarious. But. We'll keep you updated on how everything's going. Good morning, guys. So last night we went to a comedy show and then a game show called Battle of the Sexes. They were both really funny and fun. Um, we woke up a little bit ago. We just kind of relaxed in bed. We're gonna go sit down for breakfast and then go for a walk on the top deck and go to bingo. So I'll take you along with us this morning. We just got back to the room and we got another towel animal. It's so cute. I woke up and went to the gym. I went, did a run and just a stretch. And we went to bumper cars, which was so much fun actually. If you are on one of the boats that does it, I definitely recommend doing it. It was a lot of fun. And it was, they're like faster than normal bumper cars. So it was really cool. Then we are going to go grab lunch at the Brass and Brock. Club, I think it's called. They have poutine there, so Brian wants to try that. So we're gonna go there and then get in our bathing suits and have one last day of relaxing in the sun. Mm -hmm. 